I guess in this video, I'm going to discuss what created identifier in Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio. So, you want to create an identifier. So, add here if uh, we want to create the table with uh, add your table TBL city and it is inside in double code. So, if you do like this, okay, then add here I'm getting the error message incorrect syntax near TBL city. That means add here state created identifier it's off. So when that off add here and if you execute to this query so you cannot to create a table with or TBL city because it comes under double code. So uh, for this we need to use add here state created identifier that on. So uh, if that on then we can create the ident or uh, add here table uh, table city. So execute and check add here. So see add here command completed successfully. So uh, table city or table that's uh, created. Here, city that's table created, and here or uh, inside. Uh, so at at this point previously did, I didn't use or uh, to create the tables columns by using double quote. So if you want, then here you can use by using at your set created identifier on. After that, you can use. Uh, so say at your city ID, it's in double quote city name, it's a double quote. Now here you can check. So go to the table or uh, city here after columns. So see add here. Or uh, this is the city ID and city name. Now here after you can insert the record also. So here after if I'm trying to make that off again, and if you execute to or uh, this query, select or uh, city. So see right here, or uh, I'm getting the error message incorrect or uh, syntax near TBL city. That means if you're using a uh, double quote on right here or uh, TBL city, so it must be on. After that, you can use uh, this kind of query or uh, double quote at your TBL city. After that, you can use. Now execute that. So see right here. Or uh, there is a uh, uh, TBL city created, and here uh, we are. I'm using at here or uh, double quote city ID city name, and here TBL city. It's all uh, in double quote. Now, if you want, then here you can drop the table by using or uh, drop or uh, table city. So here it's a uh, drop. Now here after let's match that. Off again. So it's off here. And you have to using created identifier setting with the single and double code. So add here we can apply double code also. So let's uh, uh, first that is the uh, off here. Now let's execute one more time. So this is the off. Now here after I'm going to execute this key. So see add here or uh, since uh, there is uh, nothing like uh, there is no any double code, so there is no any problem to create the table. Now here after when I'm trying to insert the record inside or uh, inside add here or uh, TBL item, so it's all or uh, inserted. Now here after I'm going to do one more thing. So here you can check. Uh, select a star from here or uh, uh, TBL add-on. Now you can see the output at here. So one single code. So we can apply double code and here uh, after that single code, single code, double code. And here uh, single code at this point. And here uh, two double single codes and double codes. Here after double codes and two double codes. So we can insert record like this or we can insert rows like this. 
Now here after I'm going to make the on. So I just on that property. Now here after I'm going trying to insert records. So add here again that accepted the records. Now you can check one more row inserted. So see add here one more row inserted. Now here after let's make that off. Or created identifier it just off. Now here I'm going to insert one more rows. So one row affected. That means right here if you're using condition like this create table, so there is no any double quotes. Then uh, it doesn't mean it to created identifier on or off that will insert the records. So a literal string can be single or double quote quotation mark. And we can insert the letter add here, letter or a string values. And here, a string inside double quote quotation mark are now treated as an object name. So it's just treated as an option object name. So that they cannot be used for letters. Now, if you uh, add here, if that condition add here, it's uh, uh, off. Then you cannot to create any table uh, that has a double code. Now, if you execute this query, so definitely you find add here error. So this is the things I want to uh, set created identifier in Microsoft SQL Server. So if you want to use a uh, table, if you want to create the table that has double code so you must uh, set this property created identifier on after that you can create the tables and here after uh, that you can insert the select the rows sorry select the columns so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you